ha, ha, ha. What it do, what it do, what it do All my paper chasers for life squad All my YouTubers, Facebookers, CBL holders Yes, sir, you know who you is, man We family, ain't no doubt about it Hope everybody out there doing all right Hope they're all out there chasing that paper Catching that paper, putting that paper away For a rainy day Yes, sir Over here still in uh, Aurora, Colorado Just finished getting unloaded just finished sending in that paperwork, getting that money straight. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. About to close these doors and get up out of here and uh, make a shake and bake on something else. You dig a film me? You dig a film me? Yes, sir. Um, today is Tuesday. Got that, uh, got that load off a day before. Got this load off the day before delivery and uh, couldn't be more happier about that. Now I can move on to the next load and pick that up in the morning. So uh, I got to uh, I got to pick up. I got to meet a driver over at the TA over in Commerce City and pick up his load and bring it over to uh, bring it on over to uh, Salt Lake City and drop it off uh, tomorrow afternoon, tomorrow evening. Yes, sir. I think it's gonna be my boy Ricardo out of El Paso. So if you're watching Ricardo, yes sir, shouting you out at the beginning of the video. And uh, if it is Ricardo, I'll see you uh, over in Commerce City in the morning. But I'm getting ready to take off to the TA right now. Everything is going good, everything is going great. Yes sir, I already sent that money in. That money is good to go. Yes sir, yes sir. And uh, booked up all the way to the 26, y'all. Booked up to the 26. So if y'all ready to do this, man, y'all know I'm always ready to do it. Let's get into it. Let's get it, let's get it, let's get it, let's go. All my wonderful people. Man, I love you guys, man. Y'all remember to get a video, thumbs up, comment, subscribe to the channel. Yes, sir. Let's go get this money. What it do this Wednesday morning, all my people over here at the TA, over here in uh, Commerce City. And uh, yeah, man, my boy uh, Ricardo just got here and uh, we about to swap trailers. And uh, he's gonna have a parking spot, I'm gonna have a parking spot. So if I wanna go back to sleep, I can go back to sleep if I want. But uh, he's over there parking the trailer and stuff, so that's a good deal. And uh, real cool dude, man, real cool dude. Uh, always a always a pleasure to meet uh, other Landstar drivers and stuff. And uh, got some drivers uh, over here that came over here, you know, got with me and decided to take the take the leap of faith, uh, pull the trigger, or whatever you want to call it came over here to Landstar and helping them out, you know, how to get their bread and stuff like that. So, hey man, it's, it feels good to help people out and, and meet people and, 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 and do this, man, because we all trying to get the bag, you dig a feel me? But uh, yeah, let me meet up with my boy right quick and swap trailers and then uh, we'll go from there, guys. Hope y'all doing all right. Hump day morning, baby. Hump day morning is hump day. It's hump time. Let's get it. What it do, my people? Yes, sir. Did the swap with my boy Ricardo. 697-525. Inspection sticker is good on it. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Make sure everything is good on it. 
Yes sir, yes sir. Real easy swap. Just says dangerous on it. Hazmat load. Says dangerous, that's all it says. Tires are in good shape. Yes sir, yes sir. Good old dropping hook. Nothing wrong with that at all, guys. If it keeps you moving, it keeps you grooving. I ain't got no complaints, cause I'm only gonna have this trailer uh, till I get to Salt Lake City. And then I'm gonna swap it out for an empty and then uh, pick up a load uh, tomorrow on Thursday morning in Salt Lake City coming back over here to Aurora. So this is a two for one special. Yes, uh, got the placards everywhere like they're supposed to be. But uh, gonna do it to it, man. Probably gonna lay down and take another little nap. That's the last placard right there. All the lights are working, everything's working like it's supposed to be. Yes, sir. Uh, boy, my boy Ricardo. That's him over there in the Peterbilt with the flashing lights on. Got that brown sugar. Yes, sir. My boy Ricardo. What's up, Ricardo? Good to see you, bro. Good to see you. No doubt. It's always good to see my peoples out here, man. My boy been having a little trouble. Had an EGR valve problem on the truck, but got that fixed and he back to rolling. So that's always a good thing, man. You know, got to keep it rolling out here. No matter what the issues are, you dig a feel me? Got to keep it rolling out here. But uh, yeah, man, real good guy. Uh, real nice talking with him. And uh, we was talking about uh an agent that canceled a load on me yesterday. It's Wednesday morning, y'all. Hump day, hump day. Agent canceled a load on me yesterday. So I asked him if he ever worked for him. Uh, and the agent is, uh, the agent code is JBX, JBD. Um, that's the third time they canceled a load on me. So uh, I will not be calling them for a load ever again. I don't care. If I'm in desperate need of a load, I do not care. I will not call those people again. Uh, my boy taking off. He rolling out. He got things to do. Got to stay busy. We all got things to do. See you later, Ricardo. Peace out, my brother. Yes, sir. Hope you watch the video. I'm going to text you to watch the video. Uh, when I drop it on, uh, I'm going to drop this video on Friday. So, uh, yeah, man, y'all be looking out for it. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And uh, I'm going to text him and let him know to be looking for it on Friday. So, uh, yeah, man, I will not put another load for them people. And uh, I, I don't care. That's the third time you done got me. And uh, I wasn't supposed to pick their load up until the 15th over in Oklahoma. And it was supposed to be going to Tolleson. But, uh, uh, the drop off on the 17th in Tolleson and uh, they almost messed up my they almost messed up my plans but I found another load and uh, that that's all that matters man got on that load board and found another load I could do so they didn't they didn't stop nothing y'all ain't stopping nothing y'all don't stop my y'all don't stop my shine one monkey don't stop no show you can feel me but uh, I'm gonna take me another little nap and then I'm gonna get up and get up out of here and uh, we'll get this thing moving, man. I'm gonna get some fuel here because for us, fuel here is $2.88. Um, I, don't, I don't know the regular price. Let's see if I can walk back here and see the regular price. Because uh, I'm to the right of the fuel island, but I don't know if I'm gonna see the price. No, I don't see it. I don't see it nowhere. Cause there's the shop. There's where you go in at over there. My boy Ricardo is pulled up in the fuel island. He about to get some go-go juice. Yeah, but we're getting it for 288 over here. So uh, yeah, man. That, that old boy got that brown Peterbilt there stretched out.
come over here. You can come over here and do your thing. Get it like you want it, man. Get it like you want it. Or get it how you need. You can feel me? And uh, real proud of that dude, man. Got him a real nice truck. He's, he's not he's not that old, man. So, you know, you ain't gotta you ain't gotta be uh wait until you old to uh explore your wants and needs, man. It don't matter. You can be young, you can be old, you can be in the middle. Do your thing, man. You dig a feel me? But uh, I'll get back with you guys later. Y'all be safe. Yes sir. Chase a life gear. Yeah. See that? Yes sir, yes sir. Down. Y'all know what it is. So you can go to the merch shop. Get that paper potential for life gear. Uh.
Alright guys, made it here to the Seau over here in uh, Salt Lake City. And uh, when you get here, you'll go around that way and park your trailer over there. You'll see where I parked that. But you'll walk over to the office right here and uh, give them your paperwork. You'll sign it and you're all set. It's a dropping hook. There's no uh, live load unloading here. It's just dropping hook. You bring in the loaded trailer and uh, all the empties will be against the uh, fence over there on the back side of the fence. More or less like that way over there toward the left a little bit. But uh, yeah, you park on this road right here. Uh, I don't see any markings for the road, but it's right here by the fuel island. That's the fuel island there. So uh, you'll come over here to the right of the fuel island and park your empty. Well, we got our empties parked that over here. You'll walk to the office and have them sign your paperwork, man. Yes, sir. Now, it's time to go find an empty and then uh, get up out of here. And uh, I gotta pick up a load here in Salt Lake in the morning or tomorrow that's going back to Aurora, Colorado. So yeah, man, keeping it moving, keeping it grooving. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So let me go find my empty and get up out of here, man. That's it for this trip right here. But uh, we're getting ready to start on part two. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Found me a good trailer. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. 670185. Last inspected in July. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Hold up, shouty. Hold up. Yes, sir. Got me a good one, goody goody. That's what I'm talking about, guys. That's what I'm talking about. You come over here toward the fence line and make a slight left. They're all against the fence line. They usually keep them together. You don't see them spread out everywhere to where you have to like go and search for it. Uh, just come across, just come to the fence line over here and uh, you'll start seeing them. And uh, you can sure see the, uh, the inspection dates on them. Come on. You can sure see the inspection dates on them and stuff like that. So uh, yeah, man, got a good one with the skirt on it. That's gonna help with that wind drag. And they always slide the tandems to the rear. I don't know why, but it is what it is. Ooh, this one here. Got some chunks missing out of the tire right there. But, uh, do a little walk around she had to take this but uh yeah man we got good rubber on this one got a rusty rim but uh don't care about that all i care about is it a good damn trailer damn somebody left their e-bars out here man them things are expensive why would you leave those things out here maybe because uh you have a hard time getting them in your truck and uh Look at that, man. That's money right there. That is money. But uh, somebody left them here, man. Don't have no, didn't have no use for them. But uh, yeah, this trailer's good to go. Got some, got some placards here that, you know, I don't need, but they're good to have just in case, you know, you never know when you might need some placards. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna close this up. Yes sir, yes sir. Gonna close this bad boy up and hook up to it and get up out of here, man. So uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the morning and we'll get it moving and grooving. Yeah, we got good tires on this side too. Everything's looking good. Yes sir. Uh, we'll get it moving and grooving in the morning and uh, head on over there to the new place to load up and start heading toward uh, back toward Aurora. Yes, sir. Y'all be safe, man. Love you guys. Thank y'all for the support. Appreciate it. Remember, get a video, thumbs up, comment, subscribe now. Come on now. Come on now. Let's get it to 3,000. Come on. Hey, good morning all my people over here at the ID Logistics over here in uh, Salt Lake and this is suite 500 you're gonna come around the GPS is gonna bring you all the way around the building so just come around here and uh, 
go in the driver's entrance there and uh, get checked in. When you go in the door, you'll go to the right to go to the driver check-in. And uh, there it is right there, man. It's right there. See, I came from the, I came around the other way here. But uh, there's the address right there, ID Logistics. But um, they'll have you uh, give your pickup number and then they'll assign you a door. But uh, unfortunately, my load ain't supposed to be ready till one o'clock. So um, I'm just gonna back up into a slot over there. And park over there and wait on my load to be ready. She told me to come back and check in at 1230. So uh, they don't believe in loading you early. So it is what it is on that guys. But uh, yeah, man, I'm gonna put some pictures on here. Shout out to my boy, Boxley Logistics. Um, picked up his first load yesterday up in uh, Indiana. He did his orientation up in Indiana and uh, doing his first load with Landstar. So congratulations to Boxley Logistics. Yes, sir, my brother. Yes, sir, yes, sir. He uh, picked up in Indy going over to Oklahoma. Yeah, man, so uh, shout out to you, my brother. Yes, sir. So I'm gonna back up into one of those slots back there and then I'll check back in about 12.30 and go from there, man. That's about all I can do. I'll holler back at y'all in a little while. Yes, sir. All right, guys, went back and checked in at uh, 12.30 like she told me to. Did some cleaning while I was waiting. Got this girl all cleaned up, wiped down the floors, and uh, got it all cleaned up. But uh, when they assign you a door, you will come around to your door and uh, back into your door, slide your tandems all the way to the rear, chalk your wheels, and then they'll come out and uh, put a glad hand lock on your on your trailer so you don't move it. So be sure to do that for them and uh, wait it out. And then once it's all over, they'll come out and uh, let you know that it's done. And uh, you'll pull up and uh, close your doors so they can put the seal on it. And then you'll go back around to the front and uh, sign your paperwork and then you're out. Uh, it was supposed to be a 14,000 pound load, but uh, they boosted it up to uh, 37.5 and uh, 37,500. And uh, so I told the agent that I needed some more load, I mean some more money on the load because it's gonna be uh, heavier. It's, it's uh, over three times heavier than what they uh, what they said it was gonna be. So uh, she added some more money into it. Gave me another uh, four hundred dollars for it. So uh, hey man, I ain't mad at him at all. You know I'm only going uh, five hundred and thirty miles or something like that. Five hundred and forty miles. So. Uh, damn pretty damn good paying load from the beginning and now it just got even better with another four hundred dollars added on to it so i ain't mad at him at all man uh waiting for it to get loaded up and then uh get up out of here i ain't gonna weigh it because it's only thirty-seven thousand pounds ain't gonna be no need to weigh it and uh head on over there to a, start heading on over there to aurora and get it dropped off in the morning y'all know what it is man yes sir I'm gonna stop over in uh, Evanston, Wyoming, and uh, get some fuel over there, and then uh, get on over there to Aurora. So I'll see y'all uh, tonight when I stop, and uh, do some shout outs and stuff like that. And uh, thanks to all the new subscribers, man. I appreciate you guys, man, for hanging in there with your boy. Ain't no doubt about it. Yes, sir. Make sure you leave a comment on the uh, video. So I can give you a shout out on the next video. Dig a feel me? Holla at your boy.
What it do all my people, what it do? Over here in uh, Commerce City, back over here in the Commerce City, over here at the TA, man, for the night. Gonna get up in the morning and uh, drop off this load and be moving on to the next load, which I'll be dropping off on, uh, I'll be uh, uh, uploading that video to YouTube. The next video will be uploaded Monday. So uh, y'all be looking out for that, man. Definitely. Much love to you all, man. Hope y'all doing all right on this Thursday night. Uh, made it over here like about 20 minutes ago. Ran into some... Uh, instead of taking 80 all the way to 25 over in Cheyenne and coming down 25, I jumped on 287 for the first time. And, uh, man, it got ugly up over there because... Um, it was foggy, mist and rain, and, uh, it was just horrible, but, uh, it's a good road to run on if you, uh, on a dry day, of course, on a dry day is a good road to run on, it just so happens I picked the wrong day to go on it, but it was all good, man, uh, knocked off some of the miles and stuff like that, and, uh, finally made it down here to, uh, Commerce City, and uh it's dry over here <laughs> compared to all the all the mist and, and fog and rain I was in. It's bone dry over here, man. So uh this one I posted up, me and Miss Bailey posted up. And uh like I said I wanted to do uh some shout outs for you guys tonight, man, because I said I was gonna do that and I'm a man of my word, I always keep my word, you know, or at least for the 95% of the time I try to keep my word Sometimes things change Or I'll forget You know but uh, Just wanted to give you guys some shout out Show y'all some love man Cause y'all rocking with me And I definitely most 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 definitely Rock with every one of y'all man Wish I can give all of y'all a hug Give y'all a pound And uh Chat it up a little bit But uh With the world being the way it is And the economy being the way it is we got to keep reaching for that universe and uh, grabbing all this paper we can. You dig a feel me? So uh, first up, it's going to be my man, Eddie Gonzalez. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You definitely up in there, Eddie. Marcus White. You definitely up in there, homie. Uh, uh, Pookie Reese out of Shreveport, Louisiana in the 318. What's up, Pookie? Yes, sir. My man, Harold Coleman. What's up, Harold? Appreciate you, my brother. Yes, sir. J.C. Nunez. Yes, sir. Out of Los Cruces. Landstar Driver. What's up, J.C.? Yes, sir. You definitely up in there, man. Uh, Ivan Benitez. What's happening, my brother? What's happening? Yes, sir. You out here at Landstar doing your thing, brother. Much love to you, man. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, my man Tom over in Odessa. What's up, Tom? You and the family, man. What's up, my brother? Hope you're doing all right. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. My man, Gary Chapel. What's up, Gary? Yes, sir. You definitely have been there, my brother. Uh, next up, it's going to be my man out of Atlanta, Michael Henshin and his wife. What's up, Mike? What's up, Mrs. Henshin? Hope you guys are doing all right. Yes, sir. My man, Nathan Fears. Yes, sir. New subscriber out of Katy, Texas. Right there by H Town. Yes, sir. What's up there, Mr. Nathan? You definitely up in there, my brother. Uh, my man Carl Schrader. You definitely up in there. What's up, brother? Hope you're doing all right. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. My man R.E. What's happening, brother? Yes, sir. Hope you're doing your thing. No doubt. My man with the Barachos Apparel. Y'all go check out BarachosApparel.com. My man Brandon. Balderas. Yes, sir. You definitely up in there, Brandon. Yes, sir. Much love, brother. My man, Beast of Logan. You definitely up in there. What's happening, my brother? Them my Cali brothers right there over there in Cali. Yes, sir. Them two brothers right there. Some cool brothers right there, man. And uh, I like I like talking with them. I like kicking it with them and stuff. Yes, sir. My man, Solo. Yes, sir. You definitely up in there, Solo. Yes, sir. And uh, Chepe R, you definitely up in there, Chepe. I appreciate you, man. Hope I said it right. If I didn't, brother, 
get in the comments, let me know, man. But I hope I didn't chop it up, brother. You definitely up in there, Chepe. Appreciate you, Mr. R. You definitely up in there, my brother. That's gonna do it for the shout outs, man. I'ma get up out of here. I'ma go walk Miss Bailey right quick. Get up in here, throw some grub in my gut, and uh, let her let her get some grub in her gut, and then we're gonna shut it down, man. And uh, holla at mama for a little bit, and then I'll get back with y'all in the morning when I go over to drop the load off. Yes, sir. Y'all be safe, man. God bless y'all. Have a good night. Yes, sir. Much love. Yes, sir. Alright guys, made it over here to the Costco, over here at the Costco distribution, over here in Aurora, and uh, when you pull up to the gate, uh, you're going to give them your paperwork, and they're going to give you one of these things here, a little pager thing, and uh, he says when it starts buzzing, it's going to uh, it's gonna show me what door I'm supposed to go to, and uh, once I get to that door, uh, open my doors, break the seal, open my doors, and then once I back into the door, slide my tandems all the way to the rear. You never want to slide them in, slide them, slide your tandems all the way to the rear before you back in. It's best to just back in first and then slide your tandems. It's a whole lot easier. Um, and then uh, once it goes off, it'll, uh, once you get unloaded, it'll go off and it'll say that your load is complete. And then you'll pull back up to the exit gate and hand them your pager. They already signed my paperwork. They already did that. So uh, good to go on that. They already did all of that. So yeah, man, that's good to go. And uh, I'm just waiting to, uh, I'm just waiting to get in the door and then uh, get this load unloaded and get up out of here, man and uh, move on to the next load and uh, and, and get that done. It's going to be a weekend run and uh, going to knock it out. No doubt. No doubt, y'all. So I'll see y'all in a little bit when I get to the door and then we'll end the video there, man. I'll see y'all. Y'all be safe. Happy Friday. Happy Friday, everybody. Yes, sir. Happy Friday. All right, guys. Finally got a door. Gave me door 415. Uh, like I said, you're gonna open up your doors and back into your hole and then slide your tandems all the way to the rear and then uh, they'll unload it. Then once you get unloaded, um, that pager will go off again to let you know that you're all done. Your paperwork has already been signed, so you're good to go on that front. You can feel me? So, uh, Everything is good to go. And uh, that's going to do it for the video. So I appreciate you guys for the love, the support, the subscriptions, all the comments, man. Comment down below if you want to get shouted out, you know. Got to leave comments, you know. So uh, make sure you do that, guys. And uh, show the channel some love. Show your boys some love. We're going to keep this thing going all 2024 and beyond because we reaching for that universe, baby. It might be cloudy up there, but it's sun shining above them clouds. They can feel me. And uh, just want you guys to keep going out here, man. You know, it, it's, it's uh, plenty of money to go around, man. So we all got to get our part in it. We all got to take our stake in it. And uh, we all got to do the best we can out here. You know, nobody can't knock you for doing the best you can out here. You dig a feel me? Nobody can knock you out for that, man. Nobody can take that away from you. Nobody can uh, step on that because you out here doing it. You can feel me? So uh, y'all get with your boy and uh, show some love. And I'm going to say love, peace, and hair grease. I'll see y'all on the next episode. Getting ready to start up here shortly. Yes, sir. Take care, guys. Have a great weekend.
dropping this video in a little bit. Yes, sir. Be dropping a new video on Monday. Yes, sir. We're going to keep on getting to this paper. No doubt. Chase's life gear. You don't see that? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Coming down. Y'all know what it is. So you can go to the merch shop. Get that paper chase for life gear. Uh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>